the saying that trash talk, but um, that's easy to say, but hard to do in the ring. If I knock him out in the first round, they're going to say he's too small. Even if, you know, I just beat him up throughout the whole fight, they're going to say he has a lot of heart for a little guy just to come up and face a big guy. So um, I definitely have more to lose. Explain yourself and hard work, determination. Oh, because 39, 40, it's old, so you're getting slow, you're getting tired. No, it depends on you how you discipline yourself. They always repeat him that. Repeat yourself. I'm more experienced now than before. Uh, a lot of people saying that uh, no need for me to continue to box. But uh, what I'm going to do, boxing is my passion. Well, I pretty much believe that this got to motivate him. But look at the phase off. And it's totally... Oh, I'll throw it out there. Who's got the speed advantage in this one? Me. Who's got the power advantage? Me. Defense? Me. Really, bro? Technique? Me. <laughs> what? Heart? <laughs> me. I have everything. I'm so motivated, and, and that's good for me. That's good. Um, it's helped me a lot. I, actually, uh, what he says is um, it's not helping him, but it's helping me. Because um, that's give me more motivation and work hard, like uh, determination and focus. That's, I, I like that. I like that. I respect that. I respect that. how much it motivates you but he said certain things like, I'm gonna send Manny Pacquiao to retirement. I'm gonna knock Manny Pacquiao out. Do you like to knock out Manny Pacquiao? I definitely, I yeah. like to knock out all my friends. All right, all right. Resume <laughs> that you put Pacquiao to sleep, that's what you want on your resume. Oh, Come yeah. on, bro. Take it plus? easy on Manny. Okay. In your heart of hearts, would you go in and take it easy on him? No. You should retire then if you don't want to fight the top <laughs> guys in the division. Well, I keep my mouth shut and let him talk. Let my fist um, talk in the ring. It could be a short night. If I catch you on the chin, it, it could be a short night. I'm going to punish you, man. I promise you that. I promise you. If I catch you, I'm sparking him. We trained for, you know, the best opponent. We trained for a guy. I'm not just going there and walk through him. I don't know if they think I'm a Antonio Margarito or... Really? In the ring, in the bell ring, they start getting hit. Some serious so worlds, punish, though. Punish, you know. The looks change. All the strength, conditioning, workouts, and things like that. I've never seen a chin get stronger. So I think, you know, as soon as the first round he feel my power, he'll go into survival mode. And I'm not banking off power. Oh, man. I'm banking off, you know, boxing IQ. I'm ready for anything he brings to the table. You know, this is like a game of chess. When he make a move, it's, to, it's up to me to make a better move. And I know they think I'm looking over my... I'm definitely not. So he kind of claims that he's like Marquez, right? Does that change this for me? Business, a sport, to personal? Just crazy trash talkers. For me, um, like I said, all those words that I heard just give me more inspiration and determination, encouragement to work hard, believe me. But not personal? Not in personal. I'm, I've been in this uh, business more than two decades, so we're going to do our job in the ring. Totally playing with fire um, arrow. You know, I respect his skills. I, I've been watching him for a long time. You know, it has a lot of skills, has a lot of talent, but, you know, I'm still that guy. I got a crazy amount of confidence, you know, and um, I want to be the person to give him his loss. So, you know, I'm ready. I mean, a lot of stake for me. My IBF belt, um, you know, my recognition of, you know, being that guy in the welterweight division and being, you know, quote unquote, the boogeyman in the division and just being the most feared man. And, Who believes you, you know, bro? Boogeyman? I want to fight the biggest name. That was the biggest name. Teaser here, Manny. What is this fight going to look like? Manny laughing as usual. When you two touch gloves. A uh, lot of, um, all I can say is um, more action. A lot of action in the ring. Going to be a war in the ring. It's going to be a lot of action. I always respect my opponent. Um, every opponent that I have, I respect of them. And in the ring, uh, that's different. Um, doing my job in the ring. Arrow just looking at him like uh, a... What? But um, I'm sure, I'm pretty sure that He's different um, for this fight because he already come back and and he will work hard. Uh, he work hard for for this fight. I know, I know he's um, he's uh, focused in thinking that he he need to to hard, train hard to make sure 100 percent condition. He's just confident. I mean, he's a true fighter. He's a real fighter. I mean, that's what he's supposed to be. I mean, it's like a mirror. You know, I see myself in him. I mean, that's how I feel. He's a guy that has heart. He just outwills people, and he comes to fight. I mean, there's no knock against him. That's that's what his skill and his talent is. He's a guy that comes to fight, he out will. He's going to have no choice but to come forward. I get the feeling he's trying to set a trap for you, man. You know, you know, I will say this, based on my experience, I've been, like I said, 
more than two decades in this in this in the boxing. I, I experienced all those hardest fight in in life. Like boxing is a strategic yeah. game, bro. Miguel Cotto, I fight Morales, Marquez, Hatton, Margarito, uh, which is much much taller than me. N nobody will intimidate me. Arrow is like I'm not Margarito. I'm not sure why he mentions it, right? In my head, when I'm training for a fight, of course, I psych myself out and say, yes, he does have the, the power and the chin to, you know, take what I have, so I won't underprepare. But we'll see in the first round, can he take my shot? It's going to be a um, lot of action, um, good fight, more action in the ring. Arrow hopes for a one-punch KO. Good fight, I mean... I don't get the one-punch KO thing right. Working hard in training, so... We will use that in the ring. You know, that's just my mentality. Overall, I'm the best fighter in the world. And it's not mm -hmm. if I beat him, it's how I beat him. You know, I got to, you know, put on a great performance to be considered one of the best, I feel like. How does this fight end? Mm -hmm. It can in different ways. But for me, you know, I'm seeing, you know, I'm at front of, first of all, this is my hometown crowd. I mean, this is a dream come true for me just to fight at the Cowboy Stadium. Fighting in my hometown with my hometown fans and family and everyone. Arrow's voice so sound like but, a teenager, you know, to be honest. Ooh, um, you know, mutated. Sport. And I feel like, you know, this is not the ceiling for me. And um, once I beat him, you know, I will become, you know, that mega star, especially with the performance that I have in my mind that I'm going to give and I'm going to put out. Well, work hard, train hard, focus on the fight. 